Hey boys and girls, today we're going to be reading The Coming of the Holy Spirit. When Jesus left the grave alive, that first great Easter day, he told the friends that loved him so that soon he'd go away. Then you, my friends, must tell the world, my story, all must hear it. To give you power to do this job, I'm sending you God's Spirit. Then Jesus went back home to heaven, and his friends felt sad and lost. But he sent the Spirit, like he said, on the day called Pentecost. That morning in the upper room, where Jesus' friends went for prayer, a sudden noise like rushing wind roared in as they met there. And when the sound at last calmed down on every person's head, a burning flame of fire stood, bright and warm and red. This was the gift that Jesus sent. It gave them power to speak, languages like African, Arabian, and Greek. They ran outside to share the news with folks from every land. It made no difference where they lived. Each one could understand. How can they speak like this, one said. It's a miracle, I think. Most were amazed, but others said they've had too much to drink. Then Peter, chief disciple, stood and told the growing crowd, the men you see aren't drunk, but filled with special power from God. He's given us the power to speak so all can understand the story that we want to tell you to those in every land. Our Savior Jesus, Son of God, came down to live on earth. He came to Bethlehem and angels sang about his birth. When Jesus grew, he told why God had sent him from above. He healed the sick, he fed the poor, he lived his life in love. And then you killed this son of God, you nailed him to the cross. You buried him in a grave of stone, not knowing what you'd lost. But three days later, he arose, alive, no longer dead. His death has washed away your sin. Come follow him instead. The people heard what Peter said and asked him what to do. Turn from your sins and be baptized. God's calling each one of you. That day, 3,000 people joined the church at Peter's call. And that same Jesus, still today, is calling to us all. He's also given each of us new power from the Spirit. Let's share his story everywhere so all the world can hear it.